I, Devi Patra, will be taking lecture three of the online class marathon. Apart from this, uh, if you guys want to add on something, ya aap chahte ki hum kisi particular topic se deal kare. On behalf of Parchala classes, I welcome you all to our YouTube channel. I, Devi Patra, will be taking lecture three of the online CLAT marathon for the upcoming CLAT UG twenty twenty four, which is going to be held in the month of December twenty twenty three. If you are coming to our channel for the first time and you are watching this video for the first time, then you can visit our YouTube channel and the rest of the first two lectures are you can go through. So let's start for the topic of the day. Today we would be taking some important books and authors of the of those books. Jo books abhi launch hui hai recent mein hal filhal mein we would be taking up that. Uh, in this part of the segment se ye question aata hai ki uh, the name of the author, name of the publishing house, editors ka naam kab launch hui thi, kaha launch hui thi, and what is the book about? If you will go through last year's previous years question papers, आप तो सिमिलर कॉन्सेप्ट में क्वेश्चन मिलेंगे ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट आर फर्स्ट बुक इज बुक रिफ्लेक्शन इट वॉज ऑथर्ड बाय मिस्टर नारायण मगुल एंड ही वॉज इज एन एम एन एन बैक्सर एंड वॉज Launched by our finance minister Mrs. Nirmala Sitaraman. What is the book about? So basically, the book uh, gives uh, the idea about Indian financial landscape from the viewpoint of Mr. Modi. Okay. Indian financial landscape. The second book is Surashtra Tamil Sangam Prishasti. It was composed by Sri Somna Sanskrit University, Veeraval, which is situated in the state of Gujarat. It was launched by our Prime Minister, Mr. Narendra Modi. The book marks the relationship between Saurashtra and Tamil Nadu, and it is based on the historical event of the confluence of two holy places, that is Rameshwaram and Somnath. Rameshwaram is situated in the state of Tamil Nadu, and Somnath is in the state of Gujarat. Okay. When was the book launched? The book was launched uh, during the closing ceremony of Saurashtra Tamil Sangam. Okay, so you have to remember the book of Ramesh Rathri. It was launched during the closing ceremony of Saurashtra Tamil Sangam. इसके साथ एक जिक्र का क्वेश्चन ये बन सकता है कि when was Saurashtra Tamil Sangam organized और ये कहाँ पर और Saurashtra Tamil Sangam Sangha was organized between 17th to 26th April Somnath. Okay, okay. I hope this is clear. Coming to our next book, the next book is the Poverty of Political Economy: How Economists Abandon the Poor. It's authored by Indian born British economist Meghna Desai. Sometimes uh, MCQs may Meghna Desai ko M Desai bhi refer kiya ja sakta hai. तो इसमें आई होप कोई कंफ्यूजन नहीं होना चाहिए किसी को अगर बुक का नाम क्या है या कुछ भी दिया हुआ है एंड मेघना साइज दी करेक्ट आंसर एंड इंस्टेड ऑफ दैट एम डिसाइड होते तो यू हैव टू टेक एम डिसाइड ओके इट वाज पब्लिश्ड बाय हार्पर कॉलेज पब्लिशर्स इंडिया ओके नेक्स्ट बुक इज मोदी शेपिंग अ ग्लोबल ऑर्डर इन क्लास इट वॉज लॉन्च बाय जे पी नड्डा ही इज दी प्रेसिडेंट of the political party BJP that is Bharatiya Janata Party. So ये एक individual जी के question form में भी आ सकता है. The book was forwarded by external affairs minister Mr. S J Shankar. The editors of the book are Sujun Chinoy, Mr. Vijay Chotiyala, and Uttam Kumar Sinha. So what's the book about? The book basically Uh, opens up a debate on how Mr. Modi, Prime Minister Modi, has taken a decision which has changed India's image worldwide. Okay, and uh, lastly, uh, book is ne published ki hai. The book is published by Wisdom Tree Publications. Okay, 
Now, next book is Mukunda Upanishad, The Bridge to Immortality. The book is authored by former parliamentarian Dr. Karan Singh. In his fact, he that he is the son of the last ruling Maharaja of the princely state of JNK, Jokhman, Kashmir, and in the Namtha, Hadi Singh. Okay. So, here we can ask question. Now, uh, the book was launched by Vice President of India, Jagdeep Dhankar. Is this a record? You can find the fact that it's a record of the Vice President of uh, Jagdeep Dhankar and he was the first Vice President of India. That was Dr. Sarve Pali. Radha Krishna. Okay, so you have to do the fact today. Remember, Karma. Okay. Now, next point is next book is India's vaccine story from cowpox to vaccine maybe. It was authored by Sanjan Singh Yadav, additional secretary of government of India. It was released by Dr. Manusuk Mandavia. Who is he? He is the union minister. Of health and family welfare. Okay. And this is point. The other GK point is who was the first uh, Union Minister of Health and Family Welfare? That she was Raj Kumari Amrit Kaur. Okay. I hope this is clear. So, what's the book? What books talk about? The book talks about the um, India's impressive achievements in developing, producing, and distributing. What is it? Developing, number one, second is producing, and number three is distributing COVID 19 vaccinations. I hope this is clear. Coming to our next book, the next book is on General Bipin Rawat, named as Bipin, the man behind the reform. It was authored by Rachna Bish Rawat. Uh, the book is on General Bipin Rawat. He was the India's first chief of defense staff. Okay, so you have to remember he was India's first chief of defense staff, General Bipin Rawat. This book is basically about General Rawat's life, his achievements, and his. Uh, and the principles by which he lived. Okay. And this book was published by Penguin B, a Penguin Random House imprint. Next is such an other activity celebrating a maestro. Isko to aapko naam deke se maja hai ki this book is about the god of cricket, Mr. Sachin Ramesh Tendulkar. And this book was authored by Gorya Majumdar. Gorya Majumdar, uh, he's an, uh, an eminent columnist. Plus, he is a sports commentator as well. Okay. Uh, the book was released on 24th April. That is Mr. Tendulkar's 50th birthday. Especially on the birthday ke liye launched in the book. is a collection of the achievements. Of his achievements throughout his career. Uh, the next book is The Banker to Everyday Indian. SBI announced SBI State Bank of India. Announced the launch of its coffee table book to celebrate 75 years of independence and 200 years of history of SDI, which was established in 1955. So, you have to the book name and second question you put up was that when was SDI established in India? It was established in the year 1955. Really important. Uh, the book is tribute to spirit of India's independence and SBI's contribution towards nation building. And the last book which we would be dealing today is Sporting India, England, Mughal India and the Origins of Empire. It is authored by historian Nandini Das. Currently, she is a professor at the Oxford University, England. 
Uh, the book was published by Bloomsbury Publishing, and the book talks about the complex relationship between England and Mughal India in the early modern period. Okay, and uh, it talks about the British arrival in India in the early 17th century. I hope uh, everything is clear in the video and आपको points समझ आ गए हम आगे भी और lectures में discuss करेंगे recently authored books and launched books. Apart from this, uh, if you guys want to add on something या आप चाहते हैं कि हम किसी particular topic से deal करें तो please do comment. We would take that in consideration. I hope you like the video. and if you are interested in following us so please uh, like us subscribe us so that jab bhi next lecture upload hota hai aap tak bhi hum pahunch sake also we have made a telegram group jisme hum daily legal updates dete hain aap wo bhi join kar sakte hain uska scan and skip it and jo bhi humne padhaya hai it would be available to you in the link in the what document form thank you